Hello guys, my name is Fox and welcome to part 73 of our shared tribe campaign in Crusader Kings 2. Let's continue. So, in the previous episode, we've not been doing much. We've been still waiting on our, uh, our claim of uh, Tumurum to actually, like, happen. But it's not happening because our diplomat is not really that great and we're not being lucky. 14% uh, is not really that much per year. And we also picked up a new level of military organization, so... It gave us like plenty of retinue cap, so I'm sending my retinue right now to my capital, just to be able to reinforce them a little bit more when we're gonna have enough money. Oh, apparently we still have more prisoners in our, in our prisoners who receive an education, but we couldn't really ransom any more of them, so I guess I'm not gonna be not gonna be caring about that. How's our threat looking? Yeah, we also wasn't able to really to really do much worse because we still have all the all the stupid faction thing against us. No one planning to leave. We couldn't even attack. Uh... Oh, was this province? Musaid before? I don't think. I think we actually been trying to fabricate a, a claim on this, but looks like Musaid actually conquered it. So, uh, yeah, we couldn't even fabricate in here anymore. So, Murm is our best choice, hopefully. Uh, but it's probably gonna take us a quite a long time until it's gonna succeed. Okay, some more my. People marrying. And some more education need to be given to the children. What is happening here? Why are you pillaging us? That's not acceptable. Oh well, let's go to speed 5. I don't think you're uh, gonna be doing uh, much else. Should we buy a potion from you? We're already 71, so we're probably gonna die relatively soon. So sure, why not? And I don't feel well. Okay, so I'm ill. Uh, I hope that's not gonna kill me, but it doesn't really matter. So we have a decent heir. He's uh, winning the election. Oh, and we actually have two more available trade posts uh, we could build, so let's go on to that. We already claimed a lot of cost in here. So might as well continue, right? Um, how expensive is this one gonna be? 140. Not that much. 144 as well. Or is this one? Let's spend 90 instead. Uh, oh, okay, and the illness gone uh, goes away pretty quickly. Yeah, we could claim this one province maybe later. For now, we don't really have that much money, so let's gonna get the cheaper one. Because it's, it's gonna be pretty much equal. Yeah, look at this. We're soon gonna be all over the India. All over the Indian coast. A lot of our vassals already claimed, like, uh, a lot of Indian provinces. It would be nice to probably connect, uh, connect our trade post zone or... Uh, our trade zone with theirs. It's gonna be like pretty massive one. We're already up to 3.7k trade zone value. That's a lot. Um, more, ch more children needs educations. Uh, yeah, let's gonna give you a diplomacy education as well. Uh, how expensive is that to build one cavalry division? Not division, but like a, a stack. 126. Yeah, let's gonna build one. Let it start reinforcing itself. Is our reinforcement rates? Yeah, it's on the full speed. Still reinforcing pretty slowly, but better than nothing. And one of my kinsmen's died. Is it the one I've been having a way, like I've been having a special interest? We have 55 genius. We have 39 genius. No, it's not the same one. This one is still alive. But this one who's died actually also been a genius. And he died of poor health even though, he, even though he wasn't really... Like, ill or anything. That's awful. Oh well, we still have this guy, so... If we need a replacement heir, we could take him. Actually, let's go and give this guy, like, some merges. Just so he could uh, reproduce. And hopefully, like, create maybe more geniuses and more geniuses. Oh... Why it is, uh, said it twice? Yeah, like, make more geniuses, maybe make more strong ones, and the other ones. Mm -hmm. You're Yazidi. I don't know if I should give you an infidel. But it takes, like, this 21-year-old girl. And... Oh, which one I gave you? But there's two 21s. Uh... Okay, yeah, so that should be three, right? Get me back to this to this guy, please. 
Okay, so we have one, two, three. Could get one. Now let's go and try to find you, maybe like a quick one. Because we're running low on the amount of uh, girls with genetical traits. I guess I'm gonna give you this one. That should be good enough. Who the hell are you? Sultan of Abyssinia, my son in law, wants to marry my daughter. Yeah, sure. Why the hell not? <laughs> Reinforcements happening, up to 7700 retinue. We finished our pl uh, palace garden in our personal mansion. Okay. Don't really have uh, that much useful buildings left to construct in here. So we're probably not gonna be messing with that. And my wife is pregnant. Is the new one? Yeah. This one gave me no children so far. Okay. Mm, let's go and build one extra stack of retinues. And let's see. Maybe I should be replacing my diplomat with someone, someone else. I know this guy is like a powerful vassal, but come on. We have 14 diplomacy. We could get a guy with 20. Uh, I guess I'm not gonna be doing this. Any better stewards? Oh, you're 17? And you're actually a powerful vassal. That's gonna be even better. Uh, I was gonna get you here. To build spy master. Could place our... Our air. No, not going to happen. How's powerful vassals looking? Looks like I placed most of the powerful vassals in the council, so... Let's hope they're not gonna be... Unhappy. Uh... Could try to usurp Emirate of Cairo, but it's not. It's not possible quite yet. Um, is there a chance I could like go and change some of my more council laws? Or someone who's gonna be supporting me? Oh, there's like zero supporters. Really? Is no one liking me liking me on my council? I have a loyalist in here. But it still says that I'm only gonna have one vote. I only have like five pragmatists. Pragmatist council will always aim for the part of least resistance. Okay, whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, by the way, there's also a crusade still happening for the Jerusalem. It looks like the Pope is now winning pretty easily and pretty great after all. Okay, I'm losing humble trade. And there's a jihad for Armenia. What? You did. You decided. What? What's what's wrong with you? You're so freaking tiny and you decided to declare a jihad on Byzantine Empire. Yeah, good luck with that. Uh, Armenia. Armenia is, is actually, actually pretty huge, but I think you're Sunni, right? Yeah. Could actually... No, I couldn't join your war, looks like. Yeah, you're probably gonna get dragged by these guys. Uh, and now you want to marry my daughter. Uh, no. I don't think I want an alliance with you, to be honest. Uh, especially considering that you're still in the defensive pact against me, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, everyone's still still in here. How's the threat looking? Down to 82%. More I'm still not getting fabricated on. Now I'm not gonna give you any of my children. And it won't such an alliance. Mm. You need a focus. Let's gonna give you something. 220 ducats. Should we build more retinues? Probably. Now let's go and get one more. Just gonna be trying to reach the cap as soon as possible. 8,000 already. Such amount of like retinues could could pretty much win like most of the wars. At least most of the smaller ones. Mm, why are you not allowing me to revoke this shit still? Oh, because this guy is like constantly at war from someone who is at war. Yeah, that's stupid. Even though the war is not for the Cairo, I'm still not allowed to do much. Okay, we got a new son. This one is having stutter. That's not great. Sultan Yahya is no longer advisor. Okay, so we just lost an advisor for some reason. Let's go and try to... Okay. I don't know if it's the same guy or not, but uh, I'm gonna place him back. Uh, anyways, so. Our conscientions, Eindeland and Gregarious. What's Gregarious good for? Ah, for nothing, okay. Your Eindeland, uh, or I indolent and conscientious. Yeah, let's make you 
into stewardship. Uh, I don't know who this guy was. I probably should have accepted the marriage. He probably gonna ask again, yeah. Um, Sultan of Abyssinia. Oh, so there's just, uh, there was just a new... New Sultan of Abyssinia because this guy probably died. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna give you my half-sister. Why not? And I'm gonna give you my daughter. Why not? Wasn't they married to your father? It's kind of nasty. I'm gonna give you my other daughter. Sure. So we have all, all of my daughters as your wives. Or secondary wives. Okay. Oh, we could press some Tujur claims on Italy. Probably not gonna happen. Italy still is a part of this fa uh, stupid faction as well. <laughs> Fred is at 81%. You. Indolent, Hots and Brutin. Uh, sure. Don't care. A son was born to my heir. Or double sons, even. And the second one is a genius. Oh, so... So you had twins? Oh, how, how could you be twins? But one of them... Yeah, they look exactly, like, different. And one of them is actually a genius. Huh, that's cool. I didn't know that oh, it's possible possible to happen, because one of them looks like European, and the other one looks like uh, Middle Eastern. Mm, even though they have, I'm pretty sure they have the same culture, right? Yeah, they're both Bedouin. Uh, if I... I couldn't find that. I couldn't find them anymore, but that's fine. Uh, <laughs> okay. I almost thought that one of our provinces got sieged, but no, it's not ours pro uh, not our province. <sighs> Diplomat, when the heck you're gonna succeed? You need to do something in this game, you know? You need to progress. Uh, I was a local noble, is looking... Yeah, yeah, we've got three, uh, three ducats. I was gonna build one extra. Retin, you think? Or oh, maybe even more. Should we just build them... Yeah, I was gonna build it up to the cap right away. So we're gonna increase our spendings quite a lot, but we're up to 9,000 possible uh, retinue. And this guy already popping children. The one I gave a lot of wives to. Uh, and he could marry the one who's been too young. Okay. Mm, oh, after many days of hard hunting and tracking, you have finally managed to trap the white lion. Cool. It's head will adorn my wall, or I cannot slay such a beast. And it's gonna give me the same. I guess I'm not gonna be slaying him, because he's pretty cool. I managed to freaking find a white line at the age of 73. That's impressive. Look at all of the stats also. And I don't even have any genetical traits. I'm just really freaking good. Um, threat down to 80. What's the next threshold? 75. So I think one is gonna uh, drop below 75. Uh, some of these things may be gonna fall apart. Maybe not. Not sure. Uh, probably not. Mm -hmm. Micah gets slavery reinforcement. Yeah, I don't really need that, but... Thanks anyways. Uh, marriage from Egypt. You want to marry my kinswoman? Nope. I don't like you. You want a focus, affectionate and willful. I'm just gonna make you into warrior. And you're willful, timid, playful. Sure, take this. <laughs> uh, oh, you want to marry my bastard kinswoman? Should I just accept? Yeah, sure, why not? I, need, I don't need no bastards around here. She's actually still considered the part of my house for some reason. Oh well. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> this fucking guy just married... This bastard girl and executed her right away. You son of a bitch. Was it was it your cunning plan? Just take some of my household or some of my house members and execute them? <laughs> That's weird. I I I don't know. <laughs> but it's funny. Uh I don't know if it was intended or not, but still. So, is this one gonna go for whatever? Are you gonna ask me now for the other marriage to replace the girl you just executed? 
It would be funny if you were to. Uh, just learn by yourself. <laughs> okay, civil wars in here. Yeah, he's definitely asking for more of my kinswoman. Are you fucking kidding me? You just executed the one I gave you. <laughs> Come on, fuck off. Bastard. Mm. Okay, that's starting to get annoying. And there's a successful crusade for Jerusalem. So nice hospital owners got part of their lands back. How's Jer Jerusalem actually working? Oh, they have most of Jerusalem. There's a couple of... Oh, these guys are actually Catholic. Or some of them at least. But for some reason they are independent. Maybe they're gonna accept like a vassalization or maybe they're gonna get conquered. Mm. 200 ducats. Uh, for 25 prestige or... Yeah, sure. Guess we're gonna go in debt for a month. Hmm... Oh, some, there was some message about defensive pact. What's happened? Uh, nothing really. Thought someone, to, uh, thought someone left, but no. Nothing really happened. Where's my freaking claim? It's already been like 16 minutes. Uh, patrician. What's what? I don't care. Just keep the information to myself. More people marrying, sure. Oh, this game working really slow on, on speed 5. Someone just got converted to Shia, talking about Shia fate. How is our priest looking? Have you managed to convert a uh, thing I've been asking you? No, not really. <laughs> For some reason, uh, Shia fate is not really spreading uh, well through my Ephesites and the Monophysites. Kind of strange. Oh, finally! Oh, but it's gonna cost me a fucking thousand ducats. Uh, doesn't matter. <laughs> I think it's like based on my total income, but it's, it's still crazy. A freaking thousand ducats, come on. Throw me in debt so much, but let's go start marching out. Actually, probably gonna go and switch off my retinue reinforcements. Just try to get rid of this debt as soon as possible. But yeah, we're gonna start marching our retinue right away. Uh, my understand. Underfunded sheriffs. Oh, of course. The second I'm getting in debt, I get uh, get this robber bands and all this other shit in my uh, in my lands. It's gonna go go to speed four because it's probably gonna be less laggier this way. And yeah, we're gonna start marching towards Muron. Should I be declaring a war right away, or should I declare it when we're gonna be on the border? Probably when we're gonna be on the border. I think it's still gonna allow me to, right? Mm hmm. So. When we're gonna conquer this, we're gonna get claims, or uh, we're gonna get CBs on like Muram, Rus, all of these guys. So we should be able to attack them. It's probably gonna generate quite a lot of heat again. But I'm still gonna be able to eat a lot of lands before before the uh, pacts gonna get formed. So that should be fine. Actually, let's go and switch Retinue and Reinforcement to half speed at least. Our population in Samara has been converted to Shia Fate. Okay. Just learn by yourself. Uh, this guy's probably gonna start suffering attrition as soon as they're gonna reach. Actually, as soon as they're gonna be like two uh, two promises away from our border, they're probably gonna be suffering attrition right away. Mm. I was gonna try to actually smell profit in here. Maybe I could get some money from here. No, not really. Because I need some money to get rid of this debt. Because uh, for. Or the more I'm staying in the dead, the more all the more of this smuggler rings and like robber bands gonna appear. And that's not gonna be nice because they're actually decreasing a lot of stuff. Are, are they decreasing my income? Looks like not really. Okay, so maybe maybe it's not that bad. Um You go for struggle, I guess. Mm -hmm. And another one, son. And this one is a genius. Okay. That's nice attempt. I think it's... A what? We had a jolly great time dressed up as a wild man, dancing chained together and appearing shaggy and hairy from head to... to what? What the fuck is that event? Uh, to bet the fun was interrupted when a careless person set us on fire. I could get maimed. 60% chance getting wounded. 70% chance getting wounded. Hmm... 
Mm. Oh, really? I actually managed to avoid a wound. That's surprising. But yeah, this guy's now starting to suffer attrition, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, demand monetary compensation. I actually need some money, please. Mm. How much is that? 50 ducats. Okay, I guess it's gonna serve temporarily. Uh, but for now, it's actually already time for me to have a break, guys. So I'm gonna do this, and looks like we're gonna start a war with Morum in the next episode. So, if you enjoyed watching this, secret, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And if you want to leave a comment, you should do it. And I would answer as soon as I could. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.